Well, I, look, I've been fortunate to deal with um, Chinese diplomats for the better part of 30 years. And what I will say is, irrespective of what you think of China's policy or political system, they do have a very professional diplomatic core. Um, they've got very talented people in the system. What I think has changed over the past few decades is it's a much more disciplined system. So it's very difficult, especially in official meetings, for Chinese diplomats to move too far off of the established line. So I, I don't think that we should misunderstand the level of talent in the system when we look at it through its structural constraints. But I do think that as China's overall foreign policy has become more assertive, as you know, the leadership has talked about China playing a greater role on the international stage. It has gone through periods where the wolf warriorism, the change in tone from the podium, has characterized a different era of Chinese diplomacy than what we saw before. But I actually think in some ways there are, there are plenty in the system who understand the counterproductive nature of those tactics. And I've seen a little bit of a tactical recalibration over recent years in how they express their foreign policy views publicly. And also, um, we've heard all these anecdotes about Chinese diplomats, about how they have to stick to their script and there's very little wiggle room. In your experience, is it like that? I, the, again, I think we have to look at this not just from a, the perspective of China. That's actually very typical of authoritarian systems. I mean, I've met with Libyan diplomats in a previous era who are very similar. So it's, to me, a systems issue, not an individual issue. These are very disciplined authoritarian systems where the message is conveyed very clearly and precisely. The U.S. is a little bit more like improvisational jazz. We get the general thrust of the message out there, but it's not always quite as precise, but it does give you more license as a diplomat to try to shape and, and tailor your, your thinking.